Hello everybody, welcome back to Human Resource Machine, I'm Paradox Gamer, and we are at level 22 on this game, Fibonacci Visitor. And we are ready. Started this up in the last episode. So we have a little bit to, uh, to work from here. see what I did here ah, I think it's better to just clean that up oh we can just pick another one here on the tab okay so what we need is <clears throat> to outbox these numbers until we hit the number given in the inbox in this case it will be 13 and then it won't outbox 21 okay so first of all we need to preserve the zero so I'm gonna go ahead and copy from zero and copy to four Uh, actually, we don't need zero. We just need one, so we can start by bumping, bumping it up, and then copy it over there. That should be a good start. Now we need to pick the number from the inbox and put it somewhere. We can just put it in zero. There we go. And no matter what, we have to outbox the numbers 1 and 1. So we can start with that. So inbox, copy to 0. Uh, but we need to preserve one number. So I'm gonna start by copying... Copy from four and put on uh, we already have one and one. So we have to copy from four and copy to eight. We also have to copy it to nine. Yeah, so outbox that. And copy to nine. And outbox that. So now we have the two ones, and now we have to get number two. Um, so first we have to check <clears throat> No, I think no, Let's just run this one see how it goes That there Oh yeah, okay, I need copy from four. There we go. So now we need number two, so we can copy from copy from eight and add that to nine. 
I copy it there. So now we have two here, and then we have to check if this number is lower than that, because if this number is number one, then we have to stop. So we have to pick up this number and subtract that one. And if it's zero, we have to do something else. No, if it's negative. Not zero. Negative. If it's not, I have to add it back. Oh, hang on. Copy from zero, sub to nine. No, we just pick it up, pick up from nine and outbox it. That will put number two over here. And then we have to have number three over here. So we have to pick up uh, we already have two in our hands, don't we? So we should be able to just add that to 8 and copy to 8. Now we have to do the same. We have to copy from 0 and then sub 8 and jump if negative. If it's not negative, copy from 8 and outbox it. And then go back. To where we started, that would be here. There we go. So if it's zero, then we just drop it. Let me run this this through and see how it goes. Bump that up, put it there. Put that there. One and one. Now add that there. Check if it's negative. If it's not, outbox the two. Where are we? Add to zero. Okay, so when you outbox, you don't have anything in your hands, so you need to actually pick it up, pick up nine and add to eight. Copy right. from nine, add to eight. Have to do the same here then. Yeah, we actually do that already. Okay, let's run it again. Ah, check that one. Add that to that. Check that. Add that to that. This is working. So five. 
That becomes A. Next one is 13. And then it'll be 21. So what do we do if it's negative? Um, if it's negative, then we have to copy these back and add that one. That's here, right? Pick from inbox, copy to zero, copy from four, yeah. So that would be here. Might as well just bump the negative up that way. We can get rid of that one. And then get this one up here. And the same goes with that one. Like that. I think this is it, guys. Let's check it out. Oh, we already know this one. there, copy one there, copy one there, and does the same thing all over again. There we go. <laughs> Not very efficient. But very few commands, though. No, that's fine. Let's uh, move to the next one. That would be the littlest number. Level 23. To reduce our carbon footprint, management is requesting the smallest numbers only. This is a public relation exercise. The results are going straight to the landfill. <laughs> okay. For each zero terminated string in the inbox, send to the outbox only the smallest number you've seen in that string. You will never be given an empty string. Reset and repeat. So for example, this string here is 51420. Then we have to outbox zero. Okay. Um, I guess we just take one number and check with the next number if which one is lowest and then continue to do that until we have a zero and then back that. That should be easy. So from the inbox, uh, copy that to zero. Then grab the next one from the inbox and subtract that from zero. And then if it's negative, um, if it's negative, Then we have to add that number here. So we have to add it up again. And copy it to zero.
Yeah? If it's not negative... Then we just pick the next number. Let's, let's see this first. Put five there. Subtract that. That was wrong. That was wrong. We should have kept the five. Oh yeah, that's because we have... You have to put this in first. Yeah. No, hang on, hang on, hang on. It's not right? No, it has to go in here. That way. And then check that one. And then check the n check uh, check it again here. Like that. Now, if it's negative, no. If it's if you pick up one and it's zero, then we have to end it. And then pick up from zero and outbox it. And then start over. Like that. So that's 13 moves. Perfect. Yeah, I think this is gonna work. Let's check it out. the first one. In the next string we should keep number three. So far 12 is lower then six is lower so we'll keep that and then three will be even lower so we'll keep that as well and then zero picks up so we can outbox number three. Now in the next one 31 will actually be the lowest one. So we should keep that all the way through. Pick up zero and then back 31. Yep, that's the way to do it. All right. That was perfect. We got the littlest numbers. Next one will be mod module number 24. We'll uh, do that in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and come back for more. See you guys. Bye bye.